Cheers, Duncan. <laughs> We have met up with uh, Natalie and Warren. And their two dogs, Duncan and Remy. Welcome back to another episode of Eric's Camping Adventures. We're gonna go on another search today looking for some beautiful places. After an early morning departure, we are headed down 75 south in the middle of a rainstorm, just counting on the weather forecast being accurate. The weather is supposed to clear to sunny skies as we are headed south towards East Texas. Our destination for the first leg of our trip is the Sabine National Forest in East Texas, just right on the border with Louisiana and a beautiful lake. Our first option is Red Hill Lake Recreation Area. It was actually closed for the season. So we moved on to our first backup site. Even though further from the main road, it was a great option. safely at the Sabine National Forest and uh, we are all set up here Michelle and my accommodations are the 30 year old Walmart tent celebrating 30 years of marriage we'll see if we make it through it after sleeping in this thing for a week come on, come on. We were the only campers in this loop of the Indian Mounds campground. I don't even remember another vehicle pulling through to actually check out the campsites while we were camping. We just had free roaming for these two dogs and lots of wide open space. Oh my. Hey guys, I don't know if you should go in there. The Indian Mounds Recreation Area is actually a designated wilderness area, so it is prohibited to actually fly drones there, but there is also a secondary reason, which is there is a uh, military base nearby that conducts operations, so any drone flights are prohibited in the uh, Indian Mounds Recreation Area. In addition to the developed campsites throughout the Sabine National Forest, there is dispersed camping on some of the less developed forest roads. You can review the Forest Service website and find where this is permitted. Um, but we felt the adventure here was just fine. We stuck to the developed National Forest roads on this little adventure. Um, the spurs that shot off of the paved roads were pretty muddy and we had no idea what we were getting into. Wow, that definition is actually... <laughs> she's not even that wet. Poor Duncan over here. I can't believe she's not shivering. Good girl, Duncan. You're eating all the things off the ground. Yes. Purple moss included. Do you guys want some dinner? We got our campsite set up. We checked out our surroundings and it was time for some dinner. Michelle had put together some ground turkey with onions, feta cheese, and just a sprinkling of spices. And I became the provider of all the little extras in the ground turkey just to keep her hands 
that were um, yeah, soiled with the raw turkey from touching everything else. Other side. Let me just sprinkle. Yeah, you can. Is that good? Yes. When camping, it is always best to come with a couple different options for food. Some to prepare, some to just slap together quickly. Depends on how much energy you have when you get set up. These are turkey burgers. I'm just, I'm just looking, Remy. I promise I won't steal their food. <laughs> After dinner, some good company of friends, and perfecting our campfire, we decided to turn in. But not before some really good conversation around those flames. I was trying to have some of but I was also trying to be kind of, you know, like I didn't know where the employee was. Morning came quickly, and we all slept in just a little bit late. I think we all slept deeply, but kind of fitfully, and that's sort of what I do my first night out camping. I just wake up a lot. And so we got up a little bit later and I got ready to go. It's almost ready to be boiling, baby. Harbor Freight. Oh yeah. After a very quiet evening and night of camping in the Sabine National Forest, we began to head off to our next destination. Uh, make sure you stay tuned. We are headed for the Padre Island National Seashore.
We have arrived safely at the okay. Sabine. What is it? National Forest Sabine. We have. <laughs> this could take a while at this hour of the day. Take all the time you need. Yeah, go there. That'll be the.